Playful Engineering Based Learning (PEBL). We like to call it as Pebble for ease. Is a project in which uh, we are trying to bring playfulness into the everyday classrooms through developing some kits and learning resources that teachers can easily implement with their students. It is quite unfortunate that uh, the classes are the part of the school schedule that students uh, least look forward to. With the Pebble project, we are trying to bring a change in the classrooms to make the classes more fun and more engaging for the students. For this purpose, we have designed the playful engineering based learning kits which will help teachers take pebble contents into their classes and make their classes more fun more enjoyable for the students normally we see that the relation between play and learning isn't very clear like uh, in our education system we see that play is something very different and learning is something very different and in the schools we see that play happens outside the classroom in the grounds and learning happens within the four walls of classroom but uh, it doesn't have to be so and we have seen that uh, actual learning which is long lasting and even shows itself in behavior of students in their approach to any problem solving comes when students are deeply engaged in learning those things and this state of deep involvement deep engagement and enjoyment we like to call it as play i am not the regular teacher of these students i taught them only for 10 classes but uh, i am very pleased with the small impact uh, we were able to make in their lives even in this uh, short time and uh, we have a lot of wonderful stories uh, during this uh, period of 10 classes we worked with the students i feel particularly happy when i think about um, how one of the students sujan has uh, started to believe more in his ideas initially when we started the class uh, sujan didn't have a lot of faith in his ideas which would be very creative but um, if they didn't work after a few tries he would give them up and he would um, resort to the conventional way that was taught to them through our instruction sheets but as the classes progressed we could see him persisting more into his ideas taking time to troubleshoot his ideas so that change was a very important aspect of this class for me similarly i recall two students who were very new to hands on learning and steam education uh, rita and chandini even from the first class they were extremely enthusiastic they were very interested in the class and and after every class they would ask me if they could take some materials back home to continue working on their project त्यो रेगुलर क्लास में चाहे पढ़ने मात्र हो लेखने अंत्यो चीज सोने मैम सो अभी भन्ने अवेसन एंसर याद करने मत हो प्लेफुल में हमें पढ़ पढ़ने साथ ही सीक्न भी सीक् सिक्य होना साइंस बारे के रिनेटेड भी बनायो तो बेलुंगार अो सान पातलो पा पत्रिका है तीन चार वा बुक अड़ान सकने रहे हावा को फोर्स ने भी पानी तान सकने रहे अ खेले सीक्त रमाइल हो मैं यहाँ सिको साथी पेरेंट्स स्कूल बा अरुण साथी जे हम तो बना जिस कार बलून कार बना थे तो हम सेयर कर हम स्कूल में यह सीकाई रह इसको हम पीबीएल ये प्लेफुल इंजीनियरिंग बेस्ड लर्निंग को ये इंपैक्ट के बारे में अलग कर बच्चा उन्नीर जो प्रोजेक्ट सिक रहा ती बच्चा ने क्लास में स्टेप अप कर बोलने अभी रेगुलरिटी मेन्टेन करने अर्क हमें आज के सीक्न पर्चे तो टाइप को इनिशिएसन्स लाने एकदम क्यूरिशिटी बढ़ था क्या लाइक बोला उ एट थर्टी में अब मैक्सिम बच्चा अब अगिलो दिन कल आँथे सर भोलि हम के सर बंद बेला में लाइक होने टाइप को कल आई रहा थे क्या सो तो लर्निंग एटिट्यूड भी चेंज भे प्लस इन्वल्व भर बच्चा को बिहेवि अलग हमें सफ्ट स्किल्स अलग चेंज भर पाया हमें उन्नी सिके तो छे तर के सिके मैं होने टाइप को रिफ्लेक्शन भी रहते क्या आने बि एकदम क्यूरियस भर आज हम लोग पढ़ाई भो विन संबंधी पढ़ाई भो आज बलून संबंधी पढ़ाई भो आज विन एनर्जी इसी जान मिलद रहे टाइप को पढ़ाई भो एवरी टाइम उन्हीं के कई न के प्रोजेक्ट सिके कुछ आएर रिफ्लेक्ट कर हालने बानी भैस normally some very important moments of learning in our classes go unnoticed 
but uh, through my experience with teaching the playful engineering based learning classes, I was able to notice them more easily and it even made my experience as a teacher more enjoyable. For example, when students are working on a project and at some point they get an idea that the project uh, can be made better or there was something that they, can, they could have done better in the beginning but they have missed it. So they, miss, they dismantle the whole project and they try their idea. Normally how teachers see it is that uh, since the project has been dismantled, maybe that wasn't a success. But the approach of playful engineering based learning is that uh, students are actually iterating on their work. So that's an instance of uh, important learning. One of the key learning experiences for me was how learning environment can make an impact in the learning of students and their performance in it. During my classes at Lalit Kalyan, I tried two different approaches. One approach was to give them a limited set of materials along with the instructions and the second approach was to allow them to take materials from a diverse station of materials. And what I found really interesting was that in the second approach, in which students were allowed to use a more diverse set of materials, they came up with more creative, more out of the box ideas and some of the solutions were very unexpected. For example, in the periscope content, we had provided students with some rubber bands which were actually not the part of the content, they were just lying on the material table and some students, they managed to use those rubber bands to secure the mirrors in the periscope and that was a wonderful idea because we had been having difficulties with securing the mirrors for a very long time in this content and that actually helped us a lot as content designers. Playful approach to learning doesn't have to involve gamification of lessons. Learning through play can happen anywhere inside classrooms or outside. If students are able to enjoy the lesson, if they are actively engaged in the lesson and they are able to draw some valuable insights at the end.